Okay, everyone. First off, I would like to say thank you very much for sharing and commenting the hell out of the video that I did last. Uh, that thing went well past 1,200 views. Easily one of my more successful videos. Decided I would do a follow-up video to that one. And was going to do the follow-up video uh, Friday, but then some stuff come up. I'll, I'll go through what's going on. But if y'all if, if y'all could, <laughs> do, let's see if we can get this video to do the same thing. Because I really want this to be seen by Naughty Dog to see just how badly their game is is doing at the moment financially. Also, to a lot of the people that hated on me in my last video, these videos are not a critique of the fans. If you're enjoying The Last of Us Part 2, well, congratulations. You're one of the people that it was specifically made for. The critiques of these vehicle of these the vehicles. The critiques of these videos <laughs> are not against you, but they're against the conduct of Neil Druckmann and the conduct of Naughty Dog, Sony, many others. I think that's primarily one of the things that really hurt this game. Because rumors and, and other bullcrap, I think it was going to get hurt in sales, but had they not acted the way they had, had they not disrespected anyone, disrespected YouTubers, gone after people who were raising alarm bells on this nonsense uh, about the story and had not done what they had done, in other words, DMCA takedowns, all that crap, we probably wouldn't have seen this much of a bomb. Okay? But... We're going to go in here right now. Now, I stated uh, at the bottom of my video that I was going to head to another Walmart. And this is the Walmart I went to. This is on Friday. So Friday, I headed up there at lunch. I was like, you know, I'm going to go at lunch. I'm going to get my video. I get the pictures for my video. I contemplated on doing it kind of like a live thing where I would go in there. Not live, but, you know, record myself walking up to the case and looking at it. But then I realized, you know, I like... I liked the idea of being able to see what the cases were in the back. And if I'm moving my phone too fast or not, if I get home and look at it, then it was like, well, I should have done that. And I probably wasn't going back. So I decided I'd just take a few pictures. So here you can see Ghost of Tsushima copies on top in The Last of Us Part Two, And this kind of struck me, seeing Ghost of Tsushima copies, because everyone that's been, that commented on the last video said they could not find a Ghost of Tsushima copy anywhere. And there is a reason for that, which I'll get to later in the video. But I went in and looked at this. And here you go. You know, you got Ghost of Tsushima. You can see we've got uh, three on one side, four on the other. About seven copies left. Which struck me as odd. I was like, wow, you know, they, they actually have Ghost of Tsushima. Everyone's been telling me it's been off. Uh, it's It's been out. It's been sold out. I mean, trust me, we're getting there. So then I also, I, I took the picture of The Last of Us Part 2. And you can see the angry lesbian game has way more than seven copies still in there. I would say that the uh, the dispenser is maxed out. This is um, This looks almost like a fresh stack has been put in. This is the same thing we saw over at my Walmart. Where you had this fresh stack going in there. In fact, I've still got the... I've still got the pics of that. Yeah, right here. You can see where they... It's just thick stacks of games going in next to, like, NASCAR Heat and all of them. Uh, the only thing that really is probably even close to be Modern Warfare, which I don't know why that would be, <laughs> other than the fact that it's mostly... Actually, Modern Warfare, the, the one part that's worth playing is actually free on PlayStation. So, you got a PSN account, which most people do. You're, you're automatically going to get it. But let's go back, you know. I was looking at this, I thought, wow, you know, only one Last of Us Part 2 and two Ghosts of Tsushima. This must be, I, I mean, uh, you know, Ghosts of Tsushima, they've had two cases they're selling. Still pretty good, though. You know, I was thinking, you know, still pretty good over go over The Last of Us Part 2. Ghosts of Tsushima selling pretty decent. And then I took a step back, and this is the theme you're going to see with this Walmart and the other one I went to on Saturday. Which is you're going to see more copies of Last of Us Part 2 in the bottom. And they're going to be down there with games that have been selling for a very, very, very long time. 
such as Grand Theft Auto V. It's, it's almost six years since Grand Theft Auto V came out. And it's still selling better than The Last of Us Part Two right now. I mean, just... <laughs> For a game that had the fan base that it originally had, I would expect it to have sold a lot better. Considering Ghost of Tsushima does not have a dedicated fan base when it first came out. That was the thing, that's the thing that a lot of people who who watch these don't understand. Ghost of Tsushima is a new game. It has no dedicated player base. No one is talking about anything bad about it. It is in the process of growing its player base right now. If they do a Ghosts of Tsushima 2, which I think they're probably the best thing they should do is just do a Ghosts 2 and just do it somewhere else in Japan with like a samurai or a ninja or something to that effect, um, they are probably going to make more money off the second one than they did the first one if they play if they play their cards right. But yeah, you can see here we've got massive stack in the case, massive stack in the dispenser. It gets worse on the second one because the second place I go to, this is this is a town with a super Walmart, mind you. Uh, this was on Friday. My wife goes, you know, I need to go up to a, a larger city, mind you, which is currently this city that we're going to has a larger population in the process of growing. Uh, even during the COVID outbreak, they were still designating things to be constructed. They they were planning on growing even after the COVID crisis. They they just didn't even care. Uh, mask ordinances are only if you want them. You can go to Applebee's right now at this place and not wear a mask. Nobody gives a crap. I mean, just straight up. So I went to their Super Walmart. And I found this, you know, here I am, uh, you know, we're over at their Super Walmart looking at the game case area where they've got all their games. And we've got Ghost of Tsushima. And this is what started getting me to wonder what was up. Because we've got two stacks of Ghost of Tsushima and you can tell they're only pulling the game out of one side. They're not pulling it out of each one. And we've got somewhat of a stack of Ghost of Tsushima here. And we've got a small stack of it on the other side of the second stack. Now, there's a reason for this. And I'll tell you uh, when I go back to my Walmart. Because I'm going to show y'all what my Walmart looks like now. But you can see it's still selling. And selling moderately well. Last of Us Part 2. Massive stacks. May have sold a single game. Because these are a little bit uneven. It may have sold some. But they still have massive stacks of the game sitting there. If you want, if you want depression, the game with angry lesbian and angry tranny, here it is. You you can easily find it. But it gets worse because this is a larger Walmart, and you're thinking, oh, you know, two stacks. It's not as bad as the last Walmart because they had two stacks, and one of their stacks was in the shelf. They have a whole stack of games in the shelf. <laughs> this is the same... This is the same uh, Walmart. You can see it right there. Last of Us Part 2. Stacks in the shelf. Up here, Last of Us Part 2. Big, massive stacks. Okay? So, I got to looking at this whole nonsense, you know, seeing everything that was happening. And the thing that was getting me was Ghost of Tsushima. Because I was like, man, you know, Ghost of Tsushima is here. What is happening? So, uh, Sunday rolls around. And I take off to, mind you right now, we're two, the Ghost of Tsushima in two uh, different Walmarts, plus my Walmart, has pretty much swept the floor. It's still selling like crazy right now. But what happened was I go back to my Walmart, and, you know, I get to looking. Last of Us Part 2 still these massive stacks in there. Uh, looks like they're not selling anything. I found out from a guy in there that they sold one copy that he knows of, but he can't find any, but he didn't know anyone else who had sold a copy. So while I'm there, I see this also. And you see Ghost of Tsushima. Now, mind you, when I did my video 
I looked, I had done these pictures on a Monday, released the video on a Wednesday. And that's when I got, I had to go back and look at when I did the video, when I had uh, put the video out and then it hit me. I did the, I did all this on a Monday, basically. Now Ghost of Tsushima is back. It's almost completely sold out again. You're looking at five copies here, basically. Or a little, probably about seven copies. We'll be generous. So I found a guy in there and I asked him, I said, so uh, got some Ghost of Tsushima back. And he said, yeah, he said, that game is selling right now. He said, this is our second shipment. So for those of y'all that have lasted this long in the video, I'm going to say this right now. If you want Ghost of Tsushima and you want a physical copy of it, we're on second shipment right now. Sony has gotten the second shipment out, but you can see it is selling fast. Okay, They'd, he said they're probably looking at a third shipment coming in early. I said, really? So I'm like, you know, I, I go back over to Last of Us. I said, so uh, what, what shipment is Last of Us on? I said, this must be like its third or fourth shipment. He said, that's the first shipment, man. And I said, what? He said, yes. He said, that's our, our first shipment. He said, I stock these game cases myself. He said, this is our first shipment. He said, I have not stacked any new games in here. We have sold maybe one game. And I was fucking floored. I said, you mean to tell me that you're not selling any games? I mean, guys, that's why The Last of Us has so many packages. This, is, this isn't third or fourth run. This is first run. That's what we're looking at in Walmart. He told me, he said... We can't, he said, Walmart is now trying to basically cancel some of The Last of Us Part 2 because they have so much overstock, they haven't moved any of it. So, honestly, they can't receive any new stock until they sell the first stock of games. They haven't sold enough of them to warrant the second run the, or the second shipment to come in. He said, they're now trying to figure out if they can cancel the second shipment, second and third shipments, because they said, they don't believe they can even get it. It's not massively oversold, like some people were saying in the last video. It's not selling. Okay? You, you could take a stack of The Last of Us Part 2, put it in the middle of Chicago's Ninth Mile, and nobody would take it at this point. Ghost of Tsushima, you better get some guard dogs. You better get a gun. You better get some big, giant, muscular dudes. Because at some point, because if it was gold, people would be trying to bust into your house to get it almost. You cannot keep it on the shelves. It's just flying off of them. We're looking at, and, and I will tell people this right now, you're looking at Ghost of Tsushima is, like I said, it's going to be one of the hottest selling games of this year. And I know I've been critiquing some people, but I'm going to leave this this whole video critiquing one last hater in my comments. And you know who you are. You said The Last of Us Part 2 is the third top selling game in the country. Well, let me tell you something. This is the winner. Two's not a winner. Three, nobody's going to remember this. Other than cringe. Anyway, folks. I'm The Last Raider. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the video. Try to help out Share the video also, because I don't know if y'all shared this thing or what, but it just launched. So I'm we're going to try, uh, if y'all could help me get past it. If we just get one view past what the original video did, I will be satisfied. Okay, I'm not going to be sitting there saying, 2,000 views, folks. Get us up to like 2,000. No, no, no. Just get us up to like 1,000, 1,200, and, or, or 1,200 and whatever the number is afterward. And one more. That's all we that's all we gotta get to. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Stay safe, stay frosty, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye now.